What's up, everybody? I'm Alex Knight. This is more of uh, Anime Bikini Girls 3. <laughs> I'm gonna come up with some crazy names later on. And in the last episode, we had uh, Neptune go through some sort of like hyperspace graviton surge hyperspace hole. I don't know. I'm making up Overwatch and Pokemon references. Let's just go and get this mouse off of my screen. It's unprofessional. And, and we're falling. What? Falling? Totally falling, you guys. But I mean, this always happens, so I'm used to it. Something like this won't make me panic. How often does this Girl, happen? I've been falling for a while now. We're reaching uncharted territory with this flight length. Uh, this velocity is no joke. Wait, I'm sensing that I might be in danger. That's bad, isn't it? It's super bad news bears, right? Ah, what do I do? Keep your arms and legs inside of the... Wait. What? You walk so fast. You're just slow. And I know that voice be anywhere. Behind instead of come with me. God. Her but voice I really want hurts to my ears. Huh? What are those ant-like gloves? Girls? A pair of girly girls? Wow, my experience as a faller speaks volumes. It's awesome that I can make them out from way up here. Or is it my eyesight that's awesome? If I were up to bat, would I be able to count a baseball stitches? Wait, I don't care about that right now. I'm falling fast and my current landing trajectory is... Snap! Move, 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 move! Everybody move along! Nothing to see here! Hmm? Also, oh, hi, hello, who are you, girl on the right? Also, I know who you are, nobody cares about you, or at least I don't. Hey, what are you spacing out for? I'm kind of in a hurry, you know. Yeah, I know, but... But what? Um, well, mm, I wonder how I should put it. Jeez, you're such a flake. Spit it out already. Um, well, up in the sky, there's a person. There's a person, a person from the sky. In the sky? Uh, you're so hard to get sometimes. Well, what do you mean that's hard to get? I think it's more like, um, the person is falling? Uh, what? We're out in the middle of nowhere, so how and why would someone fall out of the sky? Who needs the rhyme or reason? Is Noir? Well, um, at this rate, you're a... Uh, do it, do it, fine. do it, do it! Move, 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 move! Huh? Ah! Oh, I wanted to see her get crushed! Wow-wee! What a loud crash! Damn it! I just Ouch. wanted one thing you today! I wanted to see scary? her crushed! That had to have shaved a few years off my life! Oh, You're hello. Still... Hi. You you seem awfully close right there. Uh, young lady, wherever you are, do you know who I am? I wish I didn't. What's up? Oh, nah. <laughs> a fall like this is nothing. <laughs> I'm what you'd call a seasoned sky faller. Sky fall. I, mean, I can't lose my memory every Boston single time I fall from ball. the sky. We will Whoa. stay tall, a face it all sky together. Baller. But, um, Noir is. A seasoned Oops. doormat. Sorry to freak you out. I'm Neptune. Nice to meet you. Huh? Oh, oh, I want to introduce myself, too. I'm Plutia. It's nice to meet you. Oh, Plutia. Cool. Nice to meet you. That name totally sounds like something a magical girl who loves takoyaki would have. What's a takoyaki? Wait, what? Uh, never mind. Plutia. Huh? How does somebody Too not know what takoyaki is? My taste. How about I call you Pluti? Oh, Pluti? Okay. Why not just call her Pluto? In that case, let me give you a nickname too. Hmm. I like Neppy. Neppy. Nice one, Pluti. By the by, where are we? I don't know if it's I've ever been here before. It's rain and here? This is Planetune. It was chartered just a little while ago. 
Planetune? <laughs> nuh-uh. I know Planetune like the back of my head. And that stuff about it being new or whatever is wrong. What? Really? I'm telling you the truth. Oh, uh-huh, sure. This is some kind of hidden camera reality show thing, isn't it? You picked the wrong girl to play a prank on. <laughs> Ain't no way you'd be able to trick Planetune's CPU. Whoa! Your CPU? I had no idea that you're Planeptune CPU too. I like how she pronounced that. Planep. <laughs> Allow me to reveal my true identity. Uh, wait. Two? What do you mean? <laughs> I'm Planetune CPU too. We can be CPU twins. And twins. Oh, really? Wow. Uh, what a winky dinky. Uh, I've never read a next to another Planetune CPU. But isn't that kind of weird? I'm already the CPU, so why is there another one? Why is there two? Oh, oh, hello? How long are you going to chat while <laughs> sitting on me? Oh! <laughs> ah, that's wonderful. Holy seat cushions! Someone's sprouting out of the earth! Are the mole people making their move? Mole uh -oh. people! Mole wow. people! You never told me that you're a mole person. Because I'm not, obviously. Did you forget that I was here? Oopsies. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I was having so much fun talking to Neppy that I forgot. As for you, falling out of the sky? Really? It's absurd that you fell on me like that. I mean, it wasn't my yeah, I'm sorry and all that, but it's not like I fell because I wanted to. It was one of those unstoppable, complex, plot-advancing inevitabilities, or whatever. Oh, wait. It's just noir. I take back my apology, then. Damn! Wait. How do you know my name? <laughs> Don't be so snooty. We're best buds, so there's no need for anger. It's like, I take my Stop apology back. and answer it's my like, question. Damn. Wow, Noir. You're friends with Neffy, too? I don't know this weirdo. Jeez, you're acting pretty familiar for someone I just met. Just met? What are you? <gasps> Noir. Could you be in your epic piss pot mode right now? Yes, uh, I might need yes. to understand what then, that is. I'm really sorry. I mean, I'm unharmed, so I'm sure it didn't hurt you either. Stop grabbing at me! I honestly have no idea who you are. Huh? Really? You seriously don't know me? Oh, maybe I fell on your brain. Did I transfer my penchant for memory loss to you? <laughs> The only one with brain damage here is you. Yep, that's definitely Noir. Aww, I'm so jealous. You two are such close friends. Ah, oh, we're close friends. How could you have possibly come to that conclusion? I know. Let's visit those medicine people. The folks in Windows White 10? Coast Shut up. can check you out and fix you up. Uh, you're the one who needs to see a doctor. What is up with this girl? Whatever, I give up. We're going home, Plutia. Okie dokie. What about the thing you had to do? It doesn't need to be done today. And more importantly... No! Noir, I'll vanish if you forget about me! 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 <laughs> oh, but you're free to forget about all the game cases and manuals you let me borrow that I... misplaced. It's much more important that we get this strange girl to a place where she can rest and recover. Oh, so we're going home! What? You mean that she sent her to this world? Instead of sent, it was more like a happy accident. Okay, well, I guess I'm speaking like the... Okay, so we're back to the voice acting, ladies and gentlemen. But this is kind of like, you're just desserts, huh? In a twisted and unsavory manner of speaking. <laughs> Ugh, you don't have to laugh so hard. In any event, something needs to be done. And what is this something? Um, well, I'll report it to everyone else, and they'll figure out what to do. Tossing it to the others, huh? Pathetic. Are they dependable? Everything will work out. The Serpent Sages will be able to do something. 
Sages? Probably. Are we are we are we facing off against Ganondorf? Let's see, uh, work on my Neptune voice over here. How many times do I gotta say it? Are you listening to my words? I'm me, and you know me, Noir. Oh god, I have to do her voice. Ugh, this feels hopeless. She must have hit her head really, really hard. Aw, so is Neppy gonna die? I'm not gonna spin the bucket. If I up and croak, the game will show a scream saying, You are dead. You're so stubborn, Noir. I mean, pretending not to know me is a good joke for a few minutes, but giving it up is the same as bullying. I'm not pretending. I have no idea who you are. And there she goes again. And then how come I know all your secrets, huh? Oh, you know her secrets? <laughs> She's got a dirty little secret. <laughs> yeah, right. Fine, let's hear all about me. Come on, don't be shy. Okay, I'm gonna do it. <clears throat> I'll start with an easy one. Noir, you're the CPU of Last Station. Oh, wow, Noir. You are CPU too? No, I'm not. Well, not yet. But Last Station sounds like a pretty cool name. And you got a kid sister named Uni. Gosh, I had no idea you had a little sister. Because I don't. If I did, I would have introduced you. And thirdly, the clincher. Noir has no friends! <laughs> Aw, oh, you don't have any friends? That's <laughs> so sad! <laughs> huh? Wait, does that mean we're aren't friends? Well, what are you talking about? We're, you know, we're friends. We are? Yay! <laughs> huh? Pluty, this is gonna be an itty bitty awkward question, but are you really her friend? Uh-huh. My beast friend! <laughs> beast buddy! Hey, you don't say something embarrassing like that out loud. A friend, huh? Noir? actually has a friend? No! She's a clone! This noir is totally fake! Send in the clones! What? That's pretty offensive, you know. Oh, wow. I had no idea you were a clone this whole time, noir. I'm not a clone. You need, you need to stop believing every little thing she says. Well, what's going on? Let's be cool with a K, Neptune. One with the cool. <clears throat> We've determined that the girl before us is absolutely a clone, with the same mannerisms and all. Stop talking about me like you found something out. Stop it right now. Are you two arguing? Hey, no fighting. I feel like she's in this sort of zen mode. Not like I want to or anything, it's just that this girl is so ugh. I know, I know. We just gotta blast the pseudo skin off this robot clone, Proton Cannon. You and I let it go, will you? If you don't stop with this clone nonsense, I'll get pissed. You two really are arguing. I don't like that. If you don't start playing nice, I might get angry. <laughs> My spine just froze. Oh crap! Well, we won't fight, okay? We won't. So. Calm down, please. Uh, what is going on? What is she doing? Hurry up and apologize. Yeah, we're, uh, sorry. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's much better. What is that cold feeling? And not cold like cute penguins, like cold like murderous penguins. I don't know who you are and what the nonsense is that you spew, but don't upset Plutia if you value your life. Oh, really? I don't get it, but that sounds like good advice. I'm so happy you two made up. Oh yeah, Neppy, you hit your head and now you're confused, right? Um, no, at least I don't think so. I swear, if this woman actually turns out to be a freaking, uh, turns out to come out as a dragon in real form, 
I'm gonna be pissed. Well, maybe not pissed, but <laughs> I'm gonna be excited. Well, until you feel all better, stay here. I'll take good care of you. I feel like she's smoking a little too much opium. Wait, what? Never mind. What? No, no, no. I mean, thanks, but you listen to the words my mouth was wheezing. You can't be serious, Plutia. You'll let some weird girl you don't even know stay here? I'm always serious. We all know that a CPU helps those in need, don't we? True. What if she's an underling for the Seven Sages? That'd spell major trouble. The Seven Sages? What are they? Do they come in dark chocolate? <laughs> Don't worry. Neppy isn't a bad girl. I guess. The odds are really low for them to employ someone this empty-headed. Ah, uh, come on! What are the chocolate sage things? Tell me, tell me! Pipe down. I'm not obligated to tell you anything. Boo! Why are you being such a mean bean machine? What? Don't call me that! Are you two going to start fighting after all? Th nope! We have no intention of fighting at all! Isn't that right? Right! We're friends forever! Look at how we hug and don't cringe! Oh, how sweet. I guess I misunderstood. I'll repeat myself last time. If you stay here, do not make Claudia angry. Got it? Do not touch it! <laughs> yeah. Cerulean Cave. <laughs> I will be in Cerulean Cave. And if you touch, and if you see something that isn't real, do not touch it! Alright. Okay, even though I'm against it, let's put aside the fact that you're keeping her here until she's better. Um, where do we put it? Well, blow my cartridge and call me a 64-pin connector! This is a game! This is a game? It's crazy, Retro, you guys! Hey, mind if I start it up? I can play it, right? Yes, of course I can! Power on! Now you're playing with power! Super power! Gotta love my Super Nintendo Classic. Um... Uh, whoa! Blurry pixel art! Ahoy! Ah ha ha ha! Look at this! Did they make this game in five minutes? This is the epitome of shovelware! You're fine with letting her roll all over your floor like this? Silly nappy! This, that game is best when played with a friend. Let's play together. Oh, sweet! Let's get playing. Let's get started. Hey, don't goof off with her. Aw, can't I? Just for a little bit. Yeah, come on, Noir. Just for a bit. Don't be a curmudgeon. Don't curmudgeon me. Do you even understand the situation you're in? Situation start. Now, I'm in Plutie's Basilicon with lots of old games and manga, and... So, given the situation, I've got to try them all out! Uh... Right? That's not what I meant. Before you hit your head, you might have had family or friends, no? Those people might be worried about you, so do you really think this is the time to fool around? Oh, okay, you're right. I'm like a missing persons case. Nep Jr. and Histy and them must be worried. But even if I try to go home, I don't know where I am. Aw, oh, Noir, Neppy is sick. So, are, um, more like injured? Either way, you should be nicer to the poor girl. You only say that because you want to hang out with her. <laughs> Guilty as charged. Cause we're the best around. That one's gonna ever keep it down. Well, no reason to waste brain power meant for gaming. It'll work out. So let's play! Aw, oh, no. I want to play as that character. Ugh. Knock it off, you two! Whoa! Huh? Plutia, you should be working. What kind of CPU just sits around and plays games? Aw, oh, I'm so sorry. And you! Even if you don't care about getting your memories back, at least pull your ways. No worky, no foodie. Got it. Oi, hey! Here goes Nep. Here goes War, getting all hot and bothered after telling me not to anger Plutie. Not the 
that you've both agreed with me without question. Let's move. We're going to work. Podia has been added. Dwar has been added. Nice. Alright, so we're in a... What the hell? Where are we? Otari Forest. Um, some stuff over here. Well, first, before we do anything... Wait, so we only got two... Two places? There's Planetune and Louis, and that's it. Yustuar has been added... Wait, what? Oh... Uh, huh? I feel like I'm gonna run into a familiar face today. Uh, yep. And just as I say it, it comes true... <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> hey! Hey there, Cave! How you doing? How, how's your... How's your... Uh, how's your... Big, beautiful eyes today? Nice and green and big. <laughs> Hello. Where am I? Oh, nice! It's Cave. You are Neptune, correct? Dingle-dee-doo! You got it! Everyone's favorite everything, Neptune! Then this is Planetune? I was just in Lean Box. Uh, so let me explain. I like to put myself in your box. Wait, what? Never mind. <laughs> Ignore that! Ignore that, children! I see. So, this is a different dimension. Wait, did we come to that conclusion? I feel like we've pushed forward the plot just a little bit. <laughs> Our meeting is fortuitous. While it may not be much, allow me to lend you my strength. Let us find our way back home together. Nice! Ah, uh, hello. So we got... Oh, we got, a, we got five people! Hello? Oh, wait, we got his... Wait, what? We do have Histoire. Uh... Can I actually take a look at Histoire? L look at her! She's floating on her book! And... Noir, look at her costume. And then we have... Plutia with... Mr. Kitty. A cute handmade stuffed cat doll. Okay! I know. <laughs> uh, hello. How are you? I've missed you so much. How, how, how's your dress? How's your scissors? <laughs> Get over here. Uh, let's close the store real quick. And, uh, <laughs> we got the game back together. Let's see, we got... How many, how many people are there? Also, who are you? Who are you? Let's bring the game back together! The time has come again for me to browse Enchan for all the new memes. What's the hottest trend here? Whoa! This says a boat got caught in a freak storm and a passenger went overboard and is missing. Yeesh, I hope they can swim. Ah! What is this light? It's all up in my eyes, you guys! Not the bees! It's in my eyes! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. I I feel like they did this on purpose. Gah! I, I'm gonna drown! I'm dying! Air! I need air! Someone help! Uh-huh. Where is this? Am I saved? The light gave birth to a girl. <laughs> oh my god! I can't even come and take this! The light gave birth to a girl. <laughs> oh my god. And she's all went from the I can't commentate, guys. I'm sorry. I can't even do this. Uh, uh huh? 
Behold, the face of someone who has no idea what's going on! I was caught in a storm and got tossed in the sea, and then... I really thought I was drowning. Do you know what happened? Hmm. I will answer you, because my soul is approximately 50% kindness. So, basically, a light appeared, and you fell out of it. A light? I suppose I did see a strange luminescence in the ocean. I heard laughter, too. Laughter under the sea? Yes, in the middle of the ocean. I thought I heard someone laughing, like, cuckoo cuckoo or something. Hmm. A Chunabi laugh could only belong to... Oh, I haven't introduced myself. I'm Falcom, an adventurer. Yes, we all know who you are! Falcom? Now that I look at that cute mug of yours, I guess you do resemble her. Hmm? Hey, folks! Falcom is an adventurer who fought against ASIC with us in the previous game. This chickadee is smaller than the Falcom I know, so she must belong to this dimension. I'm Neptune. Me thinks it was fate that brought us together, so it's good to meet you! Likewise. You said you got caught in a storm on a boat or something, right? Where were you headed? I'm glad you asked. There's a newly discovered island in the South Seas, apparently. A wild, unexplored land like that is perfect for an adventurer for me to explore. Nice! Exploring the Badlands! Remember, we're talking about getting some land. Those are some bad lands. Yes, I'm still new to adventuring, but I've slayed countless baddies with my trusty sword. No! Gone! Everything's gone except for my sword! Did all my other luggage sink to the bottom of the ocean? What should I do now? My supplies and my money. Oh no. Oh no! Ouch, my wallet feels for you. But wait, why not come squat at my place for a while? Huh? Are you sure? Yeah, I gotta help the helpless or something. Thank you so much, Neptune. Okay, so this looks like... Uh... Wait. Hold on. Did I fuck something up? Wait a minute. Man, what's up with this? I try to play and then I'm told to go work. This is like deja vu. Last time uh, it was hissy up in my grill, but now it's noir. How long are you going to keep mumbling to yourself? Look, we're here. Huh? That was fast. Oh wait, this is where you set those quest things, isn't it? Wow, Nappy, you know about that? Naturally. Before I came here, I was doing a whole bunch. I'm the CPU of Planetune, after all. Ah, you're such a dependable girl. <laughs> That's not the only thing I'm good at. Wait, what? Never mind. You're sticking to that story? It's getting painful to hear, so stop while you're ahead. No, you stop! It's not all in my head. I'm Planetune's CPU. It's sad that you have to make Nebby sound like a liar. Okay, listen. You're Planetune's CPU, right? Uh-huh, that's me. Which means she can't be. You founded the station, so naturally you're its sole CPU Plutia. Uh, um, I don't really get that whole explanation, but I'm totally telling the truth. I didn't want to go this far because it makes me want, makes me out to be a nasty person, but... Prove it. If you're going to insist that you're telling the truth, then transform. Transform, huh? Uh, yeah. Activate HDD. Your CPU, so it shouldn't be a problem, right? Oh, that thing! Yeah, you'd believe me for sure if I do that. Uh, oh, Noir. You should have tripped that song sooner. It completely slipped my mind. Stop delaying and do it. God, I feel like I want, I want to punch her in her face. Okie dokie. Don't rush me. Watch closely. Hiya! <laughs> Uh, wait, what? What? You don't want to transform? Just as I expected. No, 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 no way. This isn't what's supposed to happen. I smell shenanigans. Hacks! Well, I'm kind of klutzy, so my cool transformation pose must have been wrong. One more time. Hi -ya! Equip! Shine! 
confusion! Oh, what the heck? Yeah, alright, we get it. Just admit you lied and apologize. No need to keep being stubborn. I'm not lying! Why are you so mean? Why don't you transform, then? I can't. I'm not a CPU. See? See, you can't either. So don't act all snooty patooty. I never once said that I'm a CPU. Okay, then how about you, Plutie? Can you do the thing with the changing? Shut up, you idiot! Oh, sure. I can transform. Really? You haven't shown me yet. Oh, let's see this transformation. Boo, don't be a meanie. Fine, I'll transform now. Crap! No, no, no! Uh, let's, uh, let's not do that, okay? Uh, why not? Uh, yeah, why not? Yeah, why are you stopping here? Getting all panicky like that sets up my suspicious alarms. Don't say such reckless things! Uh, why are you so frantic? Never talk Claudia into activating HTD. Do you understand? Uh, okay, okay, my bad, I think? Um, I don't really get it, but now I don't have to transform? Nope, no need to do that. We had better start working. She's hiding something from me, isn't she? Well, I'm guessing we'll find that out in the next episode for right now. Urgent verification... Uh, don't want to work. Get that. Alright, so this one. Let me sort out the details for this one. I imagine I will get stronger if the skill wild activates by beating 130 of the lazy jelly thing. I want you to try it out. Try it! Go! Also, there's some events over here. Which we will do in the next episode, because honestly, this has been going on for a little too long. <laughs> Hello, nurse. Alright, so that's it for this episode of Hyperdimension Neptunia Rebirth 3. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode on Sunday. As we're back on schedule after the attempt for the, uh, Live stream. But anyways, see you guys later. Bye.